maybe. Um, there's been a lot of emotional stuff that has been happening ever since I've gotten like 40 subscribers and all this and blah blah blah. Um, and one of those things is people expecting me to do live streams, giveaways, and etc. etc. Well, first of all, is the fact that I can't always do live streams. And this is where the conversation gets a little emotional and personal. So, I have a lot of mental disorders, if you didn't already know. One of you out of the other 40 out of you does know about the, all, almost all the dis disorders that I have. And you care a lot, and you show that you care just by paying attention to me. But for those of you who don't know, um, I have a thing called bipolar, and I have, I, I believe my doctor told me I have two forms of it. Um, something having to do with that is similar to, um, my, um, PF, and then the other one having to do with depression. And with my form of depression, I don't eat much. I, I don't, I don't like talking, and I normally just keep to myself. Yes, that can be seen as me just being an introvert, but, um, it's not just that. It has to do with a lot more than that. And, um, it's not easy. Like, it should never be easy for anyone who has disorders to tell people about them. But I know someone that I can trust and I can go to just to tell them. I don't go to ask them for help because I know that that'd be overwhelming them and I know I don't like being overwhelmed. So I'm not going to go and overwhelm them. But, um... You see, if you are having issues in your life and you don't have disorders or you're not living in Africa, um, then you really don't know what a struggle is yet. Yes, I know that there are is a thing as, such as um, kids being abused by their parents. But, um, you yeah, guys, it's... it's It's not funny. You can't just come up to someone and say that here, such as, here's an example, um, So yeah, you can't just go up to someone and say, oh, yeah, my mom slapped me. Mothers slap their kids. I mean, heck, I've been hit by my mom too. But, um, it's mainly their parenting. So you can't just go up to, your, to someone that you may even trust. You just can't go and lie to them like that. It's, it can be a lie, but it can also not be a lie because... Parents slap kids. It's just parenting, okay? But you don't know a true emotional struggle until you have, like, six different voices in your head. Yeah, I'll just go with that. That voice. Um, you don't know what it's like. I'm not trying to make this video so you guys feel bad for me or anything because I already know that some of you feel bad for me just because I got scammed but um don't need to do that you honestly do not feel bad for me because I don't have the worst of it my mate's great and um lover has it worse than I do a lot worse than I do um yeah uh it's not 
like something to joke about. This video isn't meant to be taken as a joke. But, um, you guys who just make up, like, stories of, like, oh, I have PTSD, I have Tourette's Syndrome, I have blah blah blah. The people, you people like that, it's not okay. It's not okay. T.S. Tourette syndrome is part of something that I have. I just don't have the ticking. Uh, well, I have twitching. I'm twitching um in my wrists sometimes and in my neck at times. But um, it, the point of this video is that it's not okay to joke around about this stuff. It's just not okay. It's not. And I look down upon it because if I tell it like here, let's say we're in a conversation and I'm telling you about my problems because you offered to listen. And then you just keep on saying same after something that I say. And then you go on to like tell me something that I will at first believe that you told me if it's true. But, um, I can tell when someone's lying about something. Because if you're in a conversation with someone, and they're just replying the same to everything, like, it's, they're lying. Or they're just trying to, um, agree with you. But that form of agreeing... It's not okay. That's a lie. You're basically lying. But, um, you guys, it's just not okay. Don't fake that you have any mental disorders or that you have any physical disorders. Don't fake it. It's not okay. That's, one, that's lying to people. Two, that's not okay. And three, you're not being true to yourself. And in order to really have, um, a good life. Um, you have to agree with yourself and you have to believe in yourself because there are people out there in the world who aren't going to believe, believe in you. There are people who are going to plain out ignore you. I know that for a fact. But, um, they just won't care about anything you say. Nothing. Because they don't care. So, you guys need to realize that. Like, if you don't believe in yourself, then you're not going to get anywhere. So, yeah, that's the point of this video. You need to believe in yourself before you believe in anyone else. Because, honestly, I love to help everyone. I would love to be able to help everyone that I can. But, like, you can't just come up to me and lie. You just can't. It's not okay. And you can't come up to me and pretend to be someone you're not. And yeah, I know, I'm probably rambling at this point, but that's because my mind is going elsewhere right now. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to end this one video here and go edit it and then try and upload it. And yeah, you guys will see this then. Um, remember to believe in yourself more than anyone else in your life. Because if you don't believe in yourself, you won't be able to move forward. If you don't move forward, you're going to be stuck in this endless loop of pain and suffering and regret. So, please, just believe in yourself, okay? I'm here if you have anything small that I can help you with. But if you have something big, go to a professional. Go to your school counselor. Go to um, your therapist. Go to someone else who's a professional, not me, and not my mates for it either, because they don't need it. They don't need your shit. Sorry for my language, but, um, anyways, yeah, I'm gonna end this here before it ends up just getting too rambling. Bye, guys.